Team Rainbow and Rainbow Kids, your boy Mepa Table Tuba come to you guys with another video. So, I want to talk about this. It's almost 2019, and I got to say this. Um, there's a lot of hate towards, to me, I feel, transgender girls and femboys. And the reason why is because, let's be real, we're living in a hip-hop society, but there are so many men who are on the down low, so many guys, so many trade guys out there, um, and they are... Let's be let's be honest. They they love the transgender girls. As get to where now they love the fan boys that are in the makeup a lot. Because the thing about it is you have to realize this. Girls are saying, "Well, why are they attracted to a guy? That's a guy." You have to understand this. When 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 guys see a beautiful transgender transgender woman like um um the Vern Cox or um a Maya Scott or they see like a a, a fan boy dressed to make a like Tokyo styles um because you can't see them Tokyo styles. Some when we be we wear the wig and the, and the makeup. Tokyo style, I I had to show the pictures to my friend that they was like, that's a guy? I was like, yeah. But when when guys see those, see, 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 see them, they don't, they're not just seeing them as men. They're they they see them as for the feminine quality. Y'all, you have to realize when you're attracted to somebody, you're not just attracted to um, you know, their their gender, you're attracted to their 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 skin complexion. Their, their shape, you may like them thick, you may like the complexion, you may like the way they walk, the way they talk, the way they act. It's, it's, it's your track that goes way above just their gender. And that's what we have to understand. It's not that, you know, guys are looking at them as, as, as men. They're looking at them as women. They're looking at it as, oh, wow, that's a bad chick. That's a bad shorty. I like her. I want to smash. And that's what they're looking for. So you have to realize those feminine qualities or what are, what are attracting them to them. And, you, just, and you know, it's transgender women and, and film boys now. Let's be honest. They, they popping. It's almost 2019. They popping. Us popping. We popping. I'm just being real. I know I come here a lot of time with a do-rag and a chair and I be done. But, baby, one of these days, I'm going to come show you. I'm going to come show you melody. And you're going to be like, God, good God. Because, yeah, I have some people. Yeah, I'm going to just leave that at that. But, yo, yo it's just... And, 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 what, and also... I just wish there was like a rapper now that would come out and say, you know, I like transgender girls. I like feminine boys who like makeup. Because it would just, it would change the dynamic of just hip hop and everything in the culture that we live in today. Because let's just be real. There's so many transgender girls, so many feminine boys who are getting love on the, on the low from these down low rappers, down low men, trade, undercover guys, whatever. Because they're attracted to that feminine quality and the feminine traits. And they're not looking at that gender. And that's just real. So, trending the girls, the fan boys are popping. So, keeping it real. Just seeing what it is. And um, that's what it is. Popping. Love you, my loves. Bye.